Okay, so this is chapter one, number 71. Uh, here's our setup. So the deal is they want mass. And so let's look at our formula. Density is mass per volume. So mass is density times volume. If that was it, we'd be great. We'd be done. The problem's going to be when we start converting the units. So, and they ask for mass in tons. How painful. Okay. Because they're really necessary. Uh, it, uh, the, uh, this is like assumed knowledge as far as you can convert freely. They just want to make it as difficult as possible for you. So, yeah, that's the deal. Let's start with the volume. But you can do this a number of ways. The way I'm going to choose to do it, I'll just convert miles cubed to milliliters. I'll multiply by the density. We'll change, so we'll get grams. And I'm going to change grams to pounds. And I'll change pounds to tons. You can do it a different way. That's just the way we'll try it, okay? So, uh, three. if you can do this kind of conversion, you can do whatever. 3.3 times 10 to the 8th miles cubed. Okay. Uh, miles I have to start going down to uh, milliliters. Well, the standard way that may, I think of first, uh, most of these conversions you don't need to know. I'll tell you when there's one you need to know. You'll find these like for your exam on the back of the exam. So you just look it up, you write it down. But you need to know how to use it. So in one mile, oops, one mile, 5280 feet. Okay? Now I can't just do that. I have to do one more thing. Cube. If, yeah, I gotta remember to cube these. Remember on your calculator, that's the easiest mistake to make on a test or a homework. Don't forget to cube these because it's miles cubed. Okay, times feet cubed. Now where do I want to go? Inches. 12, uh, no, 1 foot is 12 inches cubed, and then uh, 1 inch is 2.54 centimeters cubed. This conversion you should know. 1 inch is 2.54 centimeters. This is the Wonderful unit to go between inches, between metric and English units. Wait, um, the first, um, uh, the second term is cubed, but why is the um, third or fourth term cubed? Okay, this one's cubed because it's miles cubed. Okay. Now we have feet cubed. So I gotta have feet cubed per inch cubed. Oh, I see. Now I have inch cubed, so I got inch cubed per centimeter cubed. Now, um, there's one milliliter. If you don't know this, this is another one you should know. For every in one milliliter is equal to one centimeter cubed. So that's just a standard volume conversion. They're they're exactly equal. Boom! I've got milliliters. Fantastic. <laughs> I'll just call this volume. <laughs> okay, you can calculate that whenever you want to. So I'm going to take my volume from here. Volume times the density, which is volume times 1.03 grams per mil. And this is going to get me a mass. Okay? I'll just call it M. And that mass is in grams. Uh, now I'd be done, except I have to convert grams <coughs> to tons. Fantastic. So mass, which is in grams, I'll put G there to remind us. It, again, it's whatever this number is, you put it in here. So, if that's helpful, I'll put an arrow there. So, grams. This is one I might have somebody look up, or maybe I'll look up in the back. This is one I always forget. I think it's 454 grams per pound. Uh, that's right. Okay. It's 454 four grams in one pound. So now I'm at pounds. Uh, and then I go 2,000 pounds for every ton. Boom! There's my answer. <coughs> I'll put a star. <laughs> it made it to tons. Is that okay? As far as all the conversions? Or... 
Um, I wouldn't necessarily expect something this painful on the exam, but conversions like this you should be familiar with.